So the song we're going to sing today is a piyut called uh, Yedid Nefesh. Uh, it's a well-known uh, piyut um, that we sing uh, normally in, um, in uh, for Shabbat. And it's a known piyut in really all the communities, all the Nuschaot, Ashkenazi Jews sing it too with a different tune. Um, so basically, uh, the tune that we're going to sing for it uh, with, with the, those words is uh, an interpretation. The tune is taken uh, from uh, uh, an Al Algerian song that's called Ya Ashikin in, uh, in, in Arabic. Uh, so the, the original is Algerian. And, um, and so you'll see that the, uh, in the beginning, I'm going to start with a, a little introduction and then we'll go um, in the song itself um, and you'll see in the song too that there will be some uh, some changes in the um, in the in the tune itself in the notes you'll realize that the tune changes and after all, when we, we heal when, when we'll hear the pute I'll tell you exactly uh, uh, from where does this change come? Kohen <speaking in> la <Hebrew> Pinhas, who Eliyahu, Cohen la El, Aelion, who. Pinhas, who Eliyah, Hanavi, Ikrahu. Hagil Adi Hatishbi Lichvod Hemdat Levavi Eliyahu Hanavi Yedi Nefesh of Harahman Meshoch Avdach El Retzonach Yalala Yarutz Avdach Kemo Ayal Ishta Have El Mul Hadarach Yalal Kie Aravlo Edi Hadurna 
نفشي حولات آفتاخ ألنا إلنا غفان لا So uh, basically, this uh, this tune. First of all, if you if you realize, we started the um, the piece by uh, an introduction. We didn't start the Yedid Nefesh directly. We started with a vocal uh, introduction that's called that that we put first of all in the words of Kohen Lael Aylion Hu. You can take every, uh, all uh, the, the psukim and the phrases that you want uh, in this part, and this part is uh, particular to Sephardic music. is a, It's a part that's called mawal, or muwal, and this 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 part of the the song is really an introduction. Instead of going right uh, through and directly starting the the song, we give a little taste of what's coming, but a little a, a little taste of what. There is also um, uh, something that's called makam. Makam in the Sephardic uh, chazanut and uh, in the Arabic music in general, it's a concept that we, um, it's a concept uh, how we classify uh, the songs themselves um, depending on the notes of the songs themselves. Makam, let's say you have different makamim, and you can recognize a makam by a certain, uh, in certain gam de note, uh, specifically, and all the songs that you, where you find this gam, the, the note, would be uh, classified in this specific makam, makam. And let's say this makam, for this song of Yedid Nefesh on the tune of Ya'ashikin in Arabic is Makam Ramil Maya. It's called Ramil Maya. We have seven Makamim different, different Makamim, and uh, each Makam has uh, his own song that share all, all of them, the, the, the gum, like we said, uh, that is common to all of them. So the, the Muwal, the introduction that we said, is basically. Uh, related to the, the, the makam of the song. Each makam has his introduction, his muel, and has songs that are classified in this makam, in this specific makam, and you choose your uh, muel depending on the makam that you want to choose. If you want to choose makam Ramel Maya, you choose this introduction that I did, and you uh, go after, and you go in a song that's from the same makam. And if you want to choose another makam, uh, you choose another muwal, another uh, introduction, and you go in a song that's from the same makam. So basically, that's really a system of classification of the songs uh, based on their uh, musical. How do we hear the musical, the notes itself in the song? Um, what's uh, specific also? You can see that uh, in the song itself, there was a part where I, I sang Hadurna Eziv Haolam. First of all, the, the basic tune was After you can see that Hadurna E, we went in another in another makam. We 
you can see that it's more uh, with more uh, sadness, more melancholy. So really, in in the song itself, true, every song has his own maka. But in the, the 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 song itself, you can have a change of maka between the different paragraphs. Also, you 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 must have heard when I sang the yalalal, the yalalal that we, we that I punctu punctuated. Uh, in each uh, end of sentence. Uh, and for us, or the yalalal, or the hanana too, is the uh, equal, equivalent, is the equal of the Ashkenazi yababai or hayayay. So we complete our songs we, to put more emphasis on the, 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 the song itself and uh, our emotions to it. We sometimes uh, uh, add the yalalal and the hanana, like uh, Ashkenazi Khazanim would uh, would add uh, yababai and hayayay. We we or or hayayay and yababai is hanana or yalalal. Uh, 